what's going on everybody so um yeah last video we talked a lot about you know getting that itch and um you know i talked to my wife about it and we decided you know hey go back to the orthopedic surgeon get seen one more time and kind of see what's what you know see what's going on so i went back to see him and he said you know what enough of this he said you've been in pain too long um with that with that shoulder which you know i got hurt in uh, September of last year and um, you know I kind of tried to push through as you remember from Thanksgiving videos and everything and I tried to do board presses tried to do floor presses to keep benching and keep training uh, but I just couldn't you know and I was tension and some massage guns and, and all these different all natural remedies and everything and chiropractors and I mean, I've spent thousands of dollars on my own body, you know, my, obviously it wasn't my hair. You see how screwed up this shit is, right? Mm -hmm. um, but, you know, I spent thousands of dollars on that stuff for no reason, really, uh, because it wasn't going away. And, uh, yeah, I don't know how many of you men are on, or you women are on high blood pressure medicine, but uh, I can't take ibuprofen because it'll destroy, you know, my kidneys and everything, my liver and blah, 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 blah and, you know, and mess up your heart and, Especially when you have high doses, like I was taking 800 to 1,000 every four hours, trying to maintain the pain or to, or to handle the pain, really. Um, I don't know why I just turned. Anyway, so, you know, I made that video in June, had the itch, saw the doc, and he was like, hey, let's try this pain shot right in the AC joint and see what happens. All right? He said, you know, in 20 minutes, it should go numb where you can move it and do whatever you want to. I said, sweet, where in the hell's that shot been, you know? Well, 20 minutes later, still in pain. Wasn't numb, still felt everything. He said, all right, well, it's time to go again. It's time to figure it out. So I went on a family vacation after that. Um, you know, took, took some Tylenol, took some, you know, aspirin, trying to help with the pain some, and, uh, Went on a family vacation, went to the beach, came back, taught some more summer school, and then he was like, all right, let's go. So two weeks ago, July 22nd, to be exact, um, I went in for surgery on my left shoulder, which is the one that I hurt in September of last year. Um, you know, now it's August, so it's been almost a full year. Um, you know, and he went in and he cleaned everything up, cleaned it out and repaired what was what was messed up. Um, I had two bone spurs, uh, a lot of arthritis that was causing uh, basically shoulder impingement because of the arthritis, uh, which we get from lifting and from playing sports and all that kind of stuff. Um, just over time, it just kind of develops. And um, you know, this was my this was my left arm when my when my left pec tore. The shoulder caught the caught the weight when my uh, right elbow went and my right shoulder went. Shaved it off the bone, essentially off of all three bones. Uh, the, the humerus, the subacromium, and all that stuff. He shaved it off. Uh, I had I had scar tissue on the supraspinatus, uh, which is a part of the rotator cuff. Had a lot of scar tissue damage in there. Uh, he shaved everything off. He cleaned everything out and subbed me back up. Gave me a brace and sent me home. I'm now two weeks post-op and um, not pain-free, obviously. They took my brace after three days, two days. I was 48 hours post-op, and the um, <laughs> the doctor comes in and goes, all right, let's see what your range of motion is. And I took the brace off, and I started moving my arm a little bit, and he goes, all right. And he took my brace from me. 
no telling how much money that brace cost my insurance and how much money my I had to pay for it. But took it away. Said you know I don't want you to do this anymore. Blah blah blah. Um, feeling good. Went to PT again the other day, and uh, they started giving me weights. As you can see, I'm using my left hand here. So doing better. Um, I am returning to the gym to do leg stuff. I can do leg stuff, some back stuff that doesn't require me reaching up and overhead. So I can do like, you know, seated rows and that kind of stuff. And um, tricep stuff, bicep stuff, you know, trying to just get back in the rhythm. Uh, I'm going, I'm gonna, I, I promised my wife, I promised the doc that I would go three weeks of physical therapy, you know, twice a week, and then I would go back, and then I would go back. I wouldn't go back a week in, I wouldn't go back two weeks in. I would go three weeks, twice a week, physical therapy, and then I would go back. So, we'll see. I'm really excited about, you know, what this could mean. Um, really excited about the progress I'm making as far as turn goes and um, we shall see. Take care guys.